I hate the word retainer because for me, it just sets off warning bells on my head, but maybe I've just had bad past experiences. But they always start so, so strong. You're a new, exciting client for that business, and so time is invested in your account. But as time goes on, you aren't the new shiny thing anymore. It's like when Buzz Lightyear shows up and you're Woody and you're just like sitting there looking at Andy's name on the bottom of your shoe. The other problem with retainers is often they are designed to require a lot of upfront work. But then once all set up, just a little check-in every now and then, tweaks here and there, and to make sure everything is running smoothly. This design means that if you are making any massive innovations or changes for or five months in, you're not being paid any more or less for it, and so often it just doesn't happen. That's why the way we run our retainers is much more like a part-time employee. Every month, you buy a set amount of time for us to sit at your kind of desk and do work for you. And as time goes on, and as we become more efficient at what we do, the more we can do for you. We don't bunk off home early because we ticked all the boxes. We nail it quicker than we did before and get to work on the next project, increasing the output. So when you are weighing up the difference between a short one-off project with us or taking on a dedicated content team for your business, don't think of it as a retainer. Think of it more like a hire. If you want to find out more, then get in touch.